Oh, welcome back for another episode of the Bard PPE Experience. We are on episode six. Leaving off from last episode, we finally got our max dex stats. Guys, we are five out of eight. Only need three more stats to be maxed. Wiz, ain't gonna take long. We'll probably get that done this video. Mana and HP, we'll see if we can get either of those done because we'll get the seasonal challenge where we get 10 pots. So we'll probably use that for like life. Um, so then we'll just have mana left maybe we just got to do a couple ocean trenches or uh, other dungeons that drop mana pots so we are on the verge of getting eight out of eight on our bard ppe with amazing gear so far mind you for not having done any end game dungeons so far we've just i mean honestly the the hardest dungeon we've done is probably o2 which is like pretty standard i mean we've done we've done one abyss and look at this, we haven't really done much of these. I should probably do a lot of these to just do them, right? Part of the whole, the challenge experience, just complete one of every dungeon. Um, haven't done a fungal, haven't done a nest, couple ice caves, I mean, ocean trench, okay. But yeah, I think O2 was probably the hardest thing that we've had to complete so far. I, Tomb of the Ancients, you could argue that Tomb of the Ancients is harder than O2, or maybe a wood lab, I'm not sure. But anyways, um, we're gonna do those grind these stats out maybe do a couple fun dungeons arenas that we haven't done I know a lot of people are popping keys right now um, so maybe we can do those see if we can get some fun loot um, but yeah we're having a good time so follow along guys like the video leave a comment subscribe if you don't want to do anything just stay along and uh, hope you guys relax and enjoy the video all right I actually have a secluded thicket ticket and I know a lot of people like opening up uh, ticket or keys in here so i'm gonna pop this one uh right now and let's do it hopefully a lot of people join uh so we can get some support i think this one should be okay though let's see what we get here zero oh wait <laughs> shows you how many secluded thickets i've done i think some people do get a drop on that first one though so this one's kind of hard to see a little bit the orange contrast is very bright. There we go. Blue bag, nice. Mana pot, perfect, just what we needed. Now this is the boss I know that kind of gives me some trouble, so we'll see how this goes. I know I'm ready to leave. Last time we found a safe spot, which really helped, but if we can't find the safe spot, then I don't know. I should just see where like everyone else goes during that time. This is the phase that I freaking hate. Oh my gosh. Wow. That was close. The problem is, is when he does that phase, like, he does, uh, sick. So I can't use my HP pots. And I always am, like, gearing, or counting on my HP pots to heal. <sighs> That's, like, the third time we've done that. All right. We're just going to run a couple of, uh... These UDLs will probably get up to... Oh, we only need nine of them. So, nine UDLs. Let's max the whiz out. Just get that over with. And then we can go back. One down. Two down. There we go. Six left. Five whiz pots to go. Three whiz left. Two whiz left. And we got a special gold dragon. What do we get here? Random pot. Dex. Hey, whiz pot. Only one left now. See if we can get it in the Davy Jones. I don't know if Davy Jones drops with pots, but uh, we are about to find out. Hey, there it is. Whiz pot number 81. We are now officially max whiz six out of eight. What the hell's he doing way up here? Holy crap. Another whiz pot. Well, I guess we don't really need that anymore. 
All we need left is now life pots and mana pots, six and four. And I think if we do our seasonal challenges, we just need to complete two more dungeons with difficulty level five or more. We can get 10 life pots, leaving with only four mana pots left. We are so close, guys. So close. Let's keep it going. Oh, we got another whiz pot. We just keep getting unlimited whiz pots here. Still just looking for two dungeons that have a difficulty of level five or more, and then we should be in a real good spot. And attack pot. I mean, I don't need any of these things, but I guess I'll just swap it out for a HP pot. Oh, wooded lab. Ah, oh, come on. Disappeared before I could get into it. This is going to be sick. If we get this hermit crab, we'll get a mana pot, and then this should be difficult five or over. Let's see. We'll see when it pops. All right, let's see what we got. Yeah, five, there we go. Oh, there was a blue pot. I missed it, dang. I don't think it would have been a life pot or a mana pot, so I don't think we missed out on too much, but. Come on. Oh, rip. Hey, a set tier. Nice, in the mana pot. Dang, rip. Just trying to dodge everything here. Just gotta keep your distance a little bit. You'll be alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Keep my distance, but the guy charging me here. is tough there we go all that for an attack pot and a death pot huh jesus i tell you i guess that counted as the level five difficulty dungeon so if we go back to the realm we should be able to claim our life pots and that'll give us max life arino so let's check it out missions reward life bada boom bada bang bada boom now, if we go to our gift chest, we should see we are here. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. And there you have it. Max life, 830 HP with our current setup. Maxed whiz in this video, seven out of eight. We only need three mana pots left, guys. That's three ocean trenches or maybe a couple other dungeons, but only three dungeons left, guys. We are so close to being eight out of eight. Stick around for the next episode because we're going to get eight out of eight, and then we're finally going to be able to do end game dungeons. Peace.